Imagine waking up tomorrow and suddenly you weigh 5% less. No diet, no workout plan, just Earth's gravity dialing itself down like someone messing with the settings. Sounds nice, right? A little lighter on your feet? Easier to dunk a basketball. But here's the thing. Even a tiny shift in gravity would quietly throw our entire world off balance. Welcome to Imagine This, where small changes can have big consequences. Today we're asking, what if gravity suddenly dropped by 5%? First, the obvious, you'd weigh 5% less. That means a 200 pound person instantly drops to 190 without stepping on a treadmill. Jumping would feel springier and carrying groceries would feel a little easier. Athletes would break records overnight, world-class high jumps, insane slam dunks, Olympic weightlifting chaos. But it's not all fun. Our muscles and bones are tuned for current gravity. Over time, they'd weaken because your body wouldn't need to work as hard to move around. Less strain sounds nice, but it leads to frailty. Think astronauts losing muscle mass in space just slower. Animals would feel it too. Birds could soar farther with less effort, but predators that rely on brute strength might lose their edge. Insects, already masters of gravity-defying moves, would thrive. Bigger jumps, longer flights. Trees might grow taller since they wouldn't have to fight as much against gravity, but their roots could struggle to anchor them in storms. Even rivers and oceans would change. Gravity pulls water downward, and a 5% drop would cause tides to weaken. Coastal ecosystems that rely on powerful tides, like coral reefs and tidal wetlands, would be thrown off rhythm. What about aviation? Planes would need less lift to get off the ground, rockets less thrust to break free of Earth, making space launches cheaper and easier. But satellites? Their orbits depend on Earth's gravity. Weaker gravity means looser orbits. Some satellites might drift away, while others fall unpredictably. GPS, communications, weather forecasting, all shaken up by a small cosmic tweak. And buildings? Engineers design skyscrapers and bridges, assuming a specific gravitational pull. 5% weaker gravity might make some structures oddly unstable, not because they're too heavy, but because they rely on that exact downward force for balance. But what about the long-term effects on Earth? That's where things really get strange. Weaker gravity would mean tectonic plates moving differently, possibly triggering more volcanic eruptions and earthquakes over time. Mountains might not rise as high before eroding, and landscapes we take for granted could look very different a few million years from now. Gravity doesn't just shape our lives, it shapes Earth itself. Right now, the planet bulges slightly at the equator because it spins. Drop gravity by 5% and that bulge would get a little more obvious. In other words, Earth might start looking less like a perfect sphere and more like a squashed basketball. Would you notice that on your morning walk? Probably not. But satellites, GPS, and space missions, they'd definitely be scratching their heads. Earth's orbit around the sun wouldn't change much. That's inertia. But the moon? The moon's orbit is tied to Earth's gravity. Weaker pull means it would slowly drift farther away. So days would stretch out tides would weaken even more, and surfers might have to find a new hobby. Now, we'd adapt, because that's what we do. Sports, science, even architecture would rewrite the rules. We'd take advantage of cheaper space travel, maybe accelerating colonization beyond Earth. But agriculture, coastal cities, and our fragile satellites? They'd all force us to innovate or risk collapse. A tiny change in gravity shows how delicately balanced our world really is. It reminds us that physics isn't just equations, 
It's the invisible glue holding civilization together. So a 5% drop in gravity wouldn't send us flying into space, but it would bend biology, technology, and even the shape of Earth itself. Turns out, even a little less weight on our shoulders could carry a massive cost. This is Imagine This, where imagination meets the edge of science. Subscribe and let's keep exploring the forces that hold our world together.